This new addition to EasyLeadCapture.com is what we call our opt-in triggers. And opt-in triggers are cool little buttons that, when clicked, bring up a very nice looking light box pop-up. And as an Easy Lead Capture user, you can control all aspects of the pop-up. You can integrate it with AWeber or GetResponse, or you can choose to use our own autoresponder system. Close that down. Triggers come in a variety of different options. You can create these custom buttons, which are mobile responsive. You can use images that we have in our library or that you may have existing or create your own. And you can also use text links so that you could have text that will lead people to an opt-in form as well. Now let's hop into the Easy Lead Capture back office and I'll show you how quick and easy it is to build these for your own website. So here we are in the Easy Lead Capture back office. The first thing we're going to do is give our opt-in trigger a name. Next up, we want to choose the Lightbox pop-up style. There's four different ones to choose from, so you can have four different layouts that you can start with. I've chosen the headline video above the opt-in form option. It automatically pre-populates these fields for you, where you can adjust the width, the background color, a border style, a border width, and a border color. You can edit the Lightbox pop-up, and this is a what you see is what you get editor, so you just simply type your content, copy and paste, whatever you want to do. Next up, we choose our contact form, thank you page, and autoresponder. So you select a contact form within Easy Lead Capture that you've already set up. You select a thank you page where you want your visitors to go after they submit their information. You set up your autoresponder, whether or not you're using the Easy Lead Capture autoresponder system or you've integrated with AWeber or GetResponse. Or if you choose no autoresponder at all, you can click no and we'll give you the option to send the prospect just a one-time email thanking them for their submission. So for this one, I'm going to use the Easy Lead Capture autoresponder. I have my series selected. Here's where the third-party integration is with AWeber and GetResponse if you need to use that. Next up, we can create our opt-in trigger or set an image. Now we have a couple different options available. This one is setting up a custom button. So the custom buttons are what I showed you on that page a second ago. An image is setting up a custom image and that's what I'm going to do right now. There's already one set up. I'm just going through the process with you. So I double click on my image and now I want to save this form. So now I've saved the Lightbox pop-up in my account and I simply open up the copy paste HTML codes, click here to generate the code, and now I copy and paste this into my website and I will show you how that works right now. So here I am in my WordPress dashboard. I've got my page open that I'd like to add this to and you can add it to any page, any post, any widgeted area, it doesn't matter, anywhere that you can paste an HTML code. So let's paste that code in there where I'd like it to appear on the page. I'll hit update. We'll go back to the page now and I'll hit my refresh button just so it brings up the changes. Here we can see my new image that I've added and it's a graphic I created and if someone clicks on it, it now opens up the light box. Another cool function of the light box is that they are mobile responsive. So they will resize themselves to fit and work on any device, any size screen. And not just the light boxes are responsive, but the actual buttons and triggers are responsive as well and will resize with the browser window. So lots of cool functionality and you can get it at easyleadcapture.com.